What you know about rolling down in the deep? Riding in the deep. Down in the deep. There it is. It's a nice fish. That's a very nice fish, actually. There we go. <laughs> She's fat. You hooked up with another red? Good stuff, boys. I'll be happy with fucking 10 trout. 10 trout? All right, spot number one. Back out here with the H and H TKO shrimp in the cock on the walk color. We have a similar water to last week. It's pretty dirty, but we caught anyway. So let's get on them. Ten specks. That's what George wants. Enough for a meal for everybody. I'll catch at least ten myself. I don't care who catches them. That's where that bait action was last week, right there. There it is. No, it's a nice fish. That's a very nice fish, actually. Let's see, well, let me see how big he is. Uh, she is 17 inches. Bam. There we go. Number one. Love to see it. All right. We're on the board. Nine more. We'll get 10. Like I was saying last week, taking it slow. I wasn't paying attention. Wasn't popping. And uh, it hit in between pops. I hear seagulls. What are they doing? All right. Oh, I jump it out the water. There we go. Got a nice one. Yeah. You got a red? I might be. Monster trout, huh? I uh, no. Absolutely. Spot lock us, huh? Good stuff, boys. Well, what you got? Let me see what you got, man. Whoo, she's fat. Real fat. We got some healthy fish over here, huh? Perfect eating size. That is a good looking fish, man. Hold on for the camera, eh? Woo! Let's go. Everybody's on the board. See, I, I, mimic, I mimic the color, just opposite. There you go. That was the goal? Instead of having the uh, chartreuse tail, I got the chartreuse head. <laughs> Let's see it. It's pretty close, man. It is pretty close. Well, hopefully it works out for you. Do we do another drift or do we hit campos? See if they got any birds. Tough call, huh? I mean, it's pretty close. I guess we can see how rough it is out there. You hooked up with another red? Yep. Another red. This one might be too big to uh, keep. Oh, I'm, am I hooked up too? I just got yanked. George hooked up on another red. I'm getting tagged while my cork's out. I should reel that in probably. Mine's underwater. I'm hooked up too. <laughs> this is between my legs. <laughs> He's gone. I was busy messing around with my camera. That's how it goes sometimes. Not even mad at it.
They're hitting it on the law. There it is. Big old red. Good stuff, George. I'm gonna throw him back. Yeah, we'll release him. He's too big. He's too big to play. Gone. Oh. Hooked up, huh? Got some? A little further out? Keep him. There goes that beer. He gone. Number two, we lost. Two in the boat, two in the water. Another nice trout lost. Well, we tried hitting another spot and uh, didn't go so well for us. So, back to the original spot. Hopefully, we could pick up a few more fish and uh, have a decent meal tonight. I think we can do it. There we go. Bring that motherfucker in. Oh, he's big. He's so big. He's big, he's big. Bring that motherfucker in. <laughs> Sorry, right. I couldn't even get his ass in, dude. We're going to have to measure that one. I had a 17 incher. What you got? I think that's pushing 18. I wasn't even hooked that good. Oh, about the same. That's a good looking fish, though. Good looking fit. This guy. Got another one? No. It got off, huh? Three. Ain't that something? Three in the boat, three lost. Two on the blow now. There it is. Bringing him in. He's coming in. He's coming in. All right. Hang out. Be cool. Be cool. Throwing up once again. Glass minnows. Look, he's got a mouth full of them. Look at that. It's crazy. It's another good fish. Not as big as the others, but. You know, a good uh, 15 and a half, maybe 16 inch fish. That one actually hit hard. You want to yank the pole out of my hand. The others were kind of lazy about it. We had a couple hours of good fish. Do we have Ziplocs? <laughs> you got them? Come on. Get him in the boat. That's a big one. That is a big fish. That might be a release. That thing's like 20 inches. Release my ass. He's hooked in the back of the throat. That's a big girl. Let's see how big it is. How big is she? 17. 17? Okay. Hold it up. We gotta get a picture with that. Come on. Yeah, you catch another one like that, I'll switch. I'm just not confident in that right now. There we go. There we go. We're rallying. We might make ten after all. Maybe. Let's see her. There we go. I think that's number six. So I think George was the king fisherman today. Two reds. In a trout. Yeah. You might have it. We ought to have we ought to have six trout. You caught two, I caught one, he caught three. If there's six in there, that's what happened. We ought to have at least two or three more. Yep. But we don't have to set a hook. We'd have our fing ten if y'all wouldn't have lost anything. Well, we just got back to the camp, cleaned up those fish, and man, that was a good day. Yeah, 
we weren't expecting the best because the conditions have been really bad out here. It's been windy all week, so we're really expecting dirty water, which we ended up seeing, but uh, we made the best out of it, and uh, the wind kept things nice and comfortable, so we ended there with six specks and uh, two reds, and yeah, that is going to be it for this one, guys. If you liked the video, drop me a like, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. You could find me in a valley of the river, man. Way out where the moccasins live. You could find me where the black water flows, where the saw grass sways and the cattails grow. Oh, I've been living where the